Good day, everyone. Welcome back. Welcome back to Android App Stars. Today I'm featuring a brand new app. Just, just, it's, it's just been available. So it's only got 1,000 downloads, but this is a, a pretty cool app. It's, it's a temporary disposable email, and I've been using. I just downloaded uh, earlier today, and I've been using it. And I, and I, and I will say that. This is a revolutionary. This is a revolutionary idea, you know, to have a, a and, and it is 100 real. I, I tried it out, and you might be asking, "Well, why have a disposable email?" Well, that's for reasons like for spam or ha- have because of the recent recent people have been hacked. You know, they have to have have their emails hacked. Then you want to have some some kind of security. And if, to say for instance, okay. I use uh, I use uh, 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 my this email to uh, enter to I entered the uh, publisher's clearinghouse, and this was earlier this evening just to test it out. Okay, so I went on. If, if you ever entered the publisher's clearinghouse before, you know that it is they, they seem to spam you with a lot of stuff afterwards. So once you once you find it, so you can uh, actually you can download it and open it up, and you can you can read the email right there from the on, on the website. So you can hit the open and uh, Gmail. Okay, so I found out it it uses your your Gmail to open it up, but they don't have your Gmail, so you just use it just to view it. So this is this is okay. This this is where it shows me where I, I did uh, enter into the into the uh, this the uh, the publisher clearinghouse uh, uh, sweet stakes, but. I won't have to worry about getting spammed by all the with all the emails that they send me. Usually, if you ever if you ever have done this before, you'll know that you just get a uh, your inbox will just be full of spam from that they send they they sit they share your email with all these other companies trying to get you to buy their stuff. So uh, I don't have to worry about that. And then and then once let me go back to the to the uh, actual app. So. You view it on your dedicated email uh, system, whatever you use. If you use Gmail, if you use Yahoo, if you use Hotmail, whatever. So you view it on there, but you don't. You receive the emails via private email server, which sounds kind of familiar, though. Through this tip mail, okay. So, and and this is completely uh, uh, secure. And uh, separate from your from your email service, so you don't have to worry about uh, sharing your 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 main email. You just you you just use this one right here. And how you do it is that you tap on it, and okay, well you you can have you can hit copy, hit the copy, and it'll copy it. Whenever you want to go somewhere, you just you just press and paste it onto whatever is asked you to put the email. And whatever, like if it's even if it's a site that you don't necessarily want to want to share your personal information, but you want to, but it requires you to use an email. This is a great alternative, and it will it will allow you to, you know, use that service. And then once once you're through with it, you can delete it and get a new one. So I I, I highly recommend this app. I say this uh, it's it's a fairly new app. It's just uh, just been on the market for for a couple days now, but it's called Temp Mail. It's a temporary email service. Uh, yeah, I wanna, let me go back. I want to share some. Uh, if you have some, uh, I was looking through the frequently asked questions, the FA, uh, FAQ. So just to give you a little overview, so uh, it says it's, it's a temporary and anonymous email service. 
and what you it, it tells you what you can and you cannot do. And what I did find out is that you you cannot send emails. So, like, if you were to, to like go to your inbox and create, you know, to e e email somebody, you can't do it like that. You can only copy and paste when it's when you're online, and it requires you to, you know, use an email, and you can just copy and paste the email to the address bar. I mean, to whatever to the to, to whatever it's asked you to, and do it like that. That's how it works. And if you could delete it. Uh, and it says it's also you you can use it you don't have to worry about it steady you can use it until you get through using it so it's it's uh you can you can check it from uh the mailbox which i just showed you you check it right uh let's see i need to go back one you check it right here well, it says zero because I don't have anything to do, but if I, if I hit the check the emails and I have to go to the website and it will show me if I scroll down that I have what I have. I've only did, I've only did the one. So and any future emails coming from this source or whatever source you, you email will, will be right here in this box right here for the sender. And you can, you, and like I said, you can click on it and you can go to using your email service that you use to you can either download it or, or you can you can open it through there but else there's no sharing there'll be no sharing of your particular email address so I thought it was it's a, it's a pretty uh, interesting app tell me what you think about it below be sure to like this video be sure to check out some more of my videos too I upload every week and thank you very much for watching. We'll see you next time.